what? What's up in that? And that was a horrible intro right there. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Anywho, <laughs> welcome back. It's welcome back to Fallout 4 for our. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> oh, that was a hilariously bad intro. Anywho, uh, I just got a tip from from a buddy, Illustrate, over on uh, his channel, Il Illustrate, as his, his channel says, that's his name. Um, yeah, he gave me a tip to quick save. Uh, um, I don't think it's you. Never mind. Okay. I'm quick saving. No, wait, no, not just quick saving. Save saving, a thing I rarely do. And, uh, new save data, just to be on the safe side. Because sometimes quick saves, uh, the the game will delete them. And now, I shall accuse the person whom I think it is. And where are they? They're they're in here, right? Uh, no, you are the paintail. Aha! You! I shall accuse. Hello, detective. Did you have a question about the heinous murder? Yes, accuse of murder. Your real murderer. <laughs> That's just silly, detective. Why would I want to kill Mr. Parker? Ah. Uh, let's go X. Ezra was embezzling your money. That's why you killed him and framed Keith. You were so close, detective. It's a shame. I thought I could keep the ruse going a little longer. Oh, well. Oh my gosh! To end I knew it! I suppose. This doesn't have to end in more violence, detective. Oh my gosh. Just walk away. I'll leave, and you can tell them I escaped. No! Ezra? You're alive. Well, congratulations on catching up, detective. Yes. I've been masquerading as Juliana for some time now. What's it going to be, Detective? Mm -hmm. Join me in getting rich or die defending some Ooh. outdated ideals? Ah. Uh, why? Why, why did you kill Juliana? I hadn't planned on it, but Juliana figured out what I was doing and had to be dealt with swiftly. I thought I could get a bit more money out of this place before making my escape. Well, how is this going to go down? Oh. I don't want to kill you. I just want to bring you to justice. Put you in jail. But, fine, I'll let you go. Okay, I'll let you go. Well, Decided to be reasonable. I would have hated for this to come to more bloodshed. All right, detective. Tell Maxwell that it's over and get your reward. All right. Then I'll make my way out when things have. I'm sorry, Valentine. Oh, no. Okay. Brain dead part two. Yeah. Yeah. Hello Maxwell. again, Detective. Was there anything else? I found Ezra. He killed Juliana, and he's been impersonating her. Oh, my. I'll notify the staff, and we can put an end to yeah. this once and for all. Hey, do you mind keeping an eye out for a second? Whew. Thanks. What did I miss? Oh, defeat? Oh, oh no. I shall defeat to thee. Hold on. No. No, Maxwell. I need a Tommy gun. Do I have a Tommy gun. I want a Tommy gun. If anyone is to have Tommy gun, 
That's right, I have a Tommy gun. Ah, you see? Thanks. Maxwell, um... Oh, bring more money. And an IV bag. Yay! Suppose someone should make use of it. Yeah, uh, Maxwell. Got him. It's finally over. There you are, detective. Payment for your services and a bonus for uncovering such a heinous plot. Mm. I don't think we could have done it without you. Thank you. Oh, that's a lot of money. Is that it? Is that it? Is that the quest complete? Brain Dead Mark 1 complete. Is that Brain Dead 2 complete though? Oh, the Protectrons, where are they going? Hey, head over there. Complete. Speak. Vault 81. Um, I think that's it! Yay! Um. Now there's no more. There's no more to do here. Oh, I kind of stinks. Cliff's Edge Hotel. Uh, good to know there's a vault here. Uh, now, <laughs> what else? Uh, um, we could continue on in the main quest, or. Uh, talk with Eddie Wright. I think I'll talk with with him. Uh, anything else? Blood Tide. Um, I'll do that. Um, I'll start. I'll um, off camera. I'll walk towards that way. And uh, if anything happens, I'll start the video a tad early. Uh, don't need to do anything here. Um, yeah. Well, yeah. So I can't have fast travel. I, this place should be very much fast travelable. Nick! Fine. Bye, Nick. I know. See you later. Forgot all about Spray and Pray. I can't believe I forgot Spray and Pray. It was Tommy Gun. Do do do. <laughs> yeah, it was just um, <laughs> recreating something I saw on Facebook, like uh, I'm on a video game. I fought like an all a video game thing, and saw like a waiting lobby thing. Showed like a bunch of uh, people like with weapons and stuff in an elevator. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't help it. Oh my gosh, this elevator! Ah! What way are we going? Do not make me get angry. You will not like me when I'm angry. Or should I say, you will not like me when I'm hungry. So you will not like me when I'm hangry. And I'm starting to get angry here just kidding I'm not I'm not angry so I'm gonna get a little frustrated cuz my gosh this elevator am I glitched I think either I, I know the elevator ride was not this long Hey, I'm ah. all ears. Well, hey, Valentine. Uh, any chance you rethought helping me close out some Nick Valentine history? Um, what kind, what of, history? kind of history are we talking here? Well, this one's straight out of the archives. Once upon a time in the land of Boston, there lived a king of organized crime, Eddie Winter. He was a bad man who did a lot of bad things, hurt a lot of innocent people. So he sealed himself. Mm -hmm. 
Ah, crap. Ah. Yep. Whoa, this is a good time as any to to, to just leave it here because this is a little glitchy. Uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> yeah, it's being weird and glitching me in the elevator. I'll give it a little more uh, off camera. And if it works, I'll start the episode uh, there and whatnot. Well, I might mean, as well continue to leave it running. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, be sure to like if you liked it. Uh, comment if you've got suggestions and subscribe if you want to see more. Uh, thank you for watching. Huh? Shush, Nick. Not right now. Uh, thanks for watching, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.